Here is a video demonstrating the process of creating a root canal guide. Start by loading the patient scan as usual, file, new project. Place an implant in the location to access the root canal. The implant should be placed so that the bottom of the implant reaches the top of the calcified canal. The implant diameter should be set to be a tenth of a millimeter larger than the tool that's going to be used for the root canal. The guide hole diameter should also be a tenth of a millimeter larger than the tool that's going to be used. If you would like to isolate the relevant tooth, this can be done easily by duplicating the relevant CT surface and using the isolate or cut tools to remove all other relevant teeth and anatomy. Keep in mind that the drill depth at which the drill will bottom out is the implant length plus the offset. These two numbers can be adjusted to adjust the drilling depth. Make sure that the software guide tube still has plenty of room and does not interfere with the patient's anatomy. Import a model by going to File, Import Diacoms, and choosing to either import an impression scan, which will invert directly in Blue Sky Plan, a model scan, or use Import STL Model to import an STL model. In this case, I imported the impression scan and inverted it directly in Blue Sky Plan to create a model. I merged it with the patient CT. All that is left to do is to draw a curve as if we were creating a surgical guide. Once the curve is drawn and we fine tune the placement using Edit Curve, we press Create Surgical Guide. And then we have our root canal guide. 